Hello, everybody. I'm Gamers101, and welcome back to Slay the Spire. I think I did an ironclad run last time. <clears throat> I'm gonna do an, uh... I think, yeah, I'm gonna do an ironclad ascension run because I haven't beat ascension mode yet. And I want to. Oh, that was weird. Okay. So, upgrade a card. Is there anything worth upgrading right now? Not really. I'd rather remove one, to be honest with you. Remove two cards for max HP minus two. I'll take the relic. Ooh, that's such a good relic, actually. I'm perfectly okay with that. Huh. Huh. Hold on a second. That ain't right. Okay. Sorry about that. Had to fix something with my uh, OBS. All right, so we don't need an early shop. I'm kind of looking at... I want to get as many campfires as I can, but I would also like to hit elites. So let's see. What's the path of the most campfires? One, two. This one would only get me three. This one would get one, two, three... One, yeah, so I'm only going to get three campfires no matter which way I go. So let's focus on elites and question marks, I guess. <clears throat> I'm kind of lacking this middle path along this way. I go this way. I think, so I think that's what I'm going to do. And I am going to try to negate as much damage as possible. I can heal up to six damage. He's going to hurt himself in the process. Yeah, that's kind of why I wanted to... Uh, he, he might be dead next turn, but blocking can inhibit my ability to do that. So, you know, he's dead. We're fine. Ooh, ghostly armor is good. Uh, it's basically just a much better block, but if I decide I don't like it, I can uh, just discard the hand and it'll go away for the combat. I'm mixed on it because it goes away, but I think I'm going to go ahead and opt for it. No, we'll hit the merchant. I don't think I'm going to get anything out of value, of value out of him. Although Clash is... If I get Clash... 75 plus 45... 40 plus 70. That's 40 plus 70. I'm, I'm bad at math. Leave me alone. 40 plus 70 is 110, so 120. I will not have enough to do both. I'm thinking I'm going to... Yeah, you know what? Let's remove a defend. Because of the fact that I have ghostly armor. So I've essentially replaced a uh, defend with ghostly armor. Uh, yeah, sure. We'll do this. Hopefully I don't lose HP. Or get a curse. As stated previously. Decay is a pretty fucking bad curse. Alright. Oh, uh, one, one other thing is I did turn on fast mode. Uh, just for anyone wondering why it lo might look like it's going fast to some of you. All right. I hate this labor. I really feel like he should not be an early enemy. I've always felt that way, but whatever. When he's by himself, I guess it's not a huge deal. Ghostly armor is so good. And he's dead. I will... Mm, I'm going to take Infernal Blade. I'm hoping one of the question marks allows me to remove a card so I can get rid of that curse. Oh, that's such a good... That was such a good, uh, get, too. Let's do that. Uh, you know what? That was actually stupid. That was, a, uh, That was dumb. I should have upgraded Infernal Blade. Uh, yeah, that was... That was just dumb. I'm gonna defend against some of this damage. And we'll hit you again. I probably could have... I, maybe I should have just hit him and killed him. That was a little stupid, but... I shouldn't have any issues this time, so uh, there's actually no reason to block. Yeah, there's actually no reason to block, so actually, yeah, we're done. Okay, uh, battle trance, for sure, because if I get into a situation where I want card draw, uh, that's going to come in handy. Uh, I'd rather, if I can get ghostly armor, that'd be awesome. I mean, I can try again. Wow. I, I'm a little disappointed, actually. 
I mean, I'm guaranteed to get it now. <laughs> Holy crap. I don't need it now. I used it just so it wouldn't disappear. Let's see if I can't get uh six twelve eight yeah, he'll die. Mm, cleave it's not really that good. I wanna skip. I, I do kind of wish I had a campfire before one of these elites. Um, I can only hit the shop or the campfire. I'm leaning more towards the campfire. But at the same time, I like... Oh, I'll get two question marks along this path. I think... This is a little risky. This elite could kill me. Uh, Wait, there's no question here. <laughs> Card removal, curse removal. Yeah, there was no question about that. All right. So let's defend, reduce some of the damage. Oh, wow, that's so good. It removes all of the artifacts. I actually didn't realize it did that. I mean, it makes sense, but it actually kind of came as a surprise. Colonel Blade. No, I could. I'm going to block all damage and just go for the kill next time because he's bound to attack. Which what? Yeah, I was right. They, they were gonna, they're going to switch off like that. So, Battle Trance. And we'll Wild Strike this one, I guess. Only thing about Wild Strike is it shuffles those wounds in. And because my deck is pretty thin at the moment, that does suck a little bit. Not gonna be able to prevent all damage, but considering that I got these these elites, which are arguably the worst ones to get, I think I'm handling this quite well. Nothing I could have done there would have helped me, so. Wild strike and a regular strike and he's dead. Okay, ooh, pen nib. Uh, how many strikes do I have? I have five. Perfected strike is tempting, but I kind of want to... I, I like uppercut, too. I think I'm going to do uppercut. All right, so... Yeah, let's use, let's use this. Let's use this. Sure. Get rid of this guy first. <laughs> I love having uh, Gremlin Horn. It's so good. Wow. All right. Let's just not. <laughs> let's just not. He'll die next turn, so we'll be okay. Even if he'd hit me, like, he'd die next turn. Spot weakness is a no-brainer. Rampage was a good competitor, but I'm actually going to... I think I should have another. Yeah, I'm going to have another one. So let's uh, smith here. I'm probably going to do Infernal Blade Spot Weakness. But if this next question mark is a combat that lowers my health a lot, then... <sighs> Let's anger the mushrooms. <laughs> Ghostly Armor is so good in free Infernal Blade. Sure. Uh, We won't be able to kill one of them. We will defend against all damage, so that's nice. Oh, next it's going to be Pendib too, so... Try to use that on something. One of the stronger attacks I've got. Uh, we'll go ahead and... Yeah, we'll go ahead and do this. There's no reason not to. Ooh, okay. That on top of Pendib is just going to outright kill one of them. 18? Won't kill ya, so... We're going to kill the one doing the most damage. Yeah. Unfortunately, that made me vulnerable. 18 damage is not something I really want to take. But I'm going to. I didn't like that, but I think it was the best option. Now that... Oh, okay. Uh... I'm kind of thinking spot weakness or bludgeon. 
want to do bludgeon. Or this, even. Do bludgeon. Some people, I know some of you guys are probably like, rescue retard. And yeah, I'm kind of thinking that maybe I should have. Oh, 10, 15. Let's do this. No, he's not attacking, so. Let's do this. Actually, I don't think he debuffs. I think that might have been a bad move. Hey. Well, why not? I wouldn't do anything, so. He's vulnerable again, but he's also got... Oh, here we go. Now, I'm thinking if I should hit him again. Some of you are probably like, you had your bludgeon, you should have fucking used it. Yeah, maybe, but... 16, huh? We'll spot weakness. I can take 11. Hit for 9. He's not weak, so we're gonna take less damage if we do this. Yeah. 5, 10, 15, that's 20. Alright. Bludgeon is gonna be super powerful right now. With a 6 plus. Oh, yes. Wait. 11, 22, 30. Yeah, bludgeon's more. Yeah, that was worthwhile. Oh, Pendib's next. 38 damage. It's kind of a no-brainer, actually. Yes, I am coming kind of close to death here. 8, 16. Oh, I'm fine. Oh, he dead. It don't matter. He dead. I'm thinking Limit Break, but Juggernaut's pretty good, but Limit Break, once I upgrade it, I don't really like entities. So I think I'm going to take Lizard Tail, just in case, because it can save my life. So we'll do that. And now I'm going to head for as many question marks as I can. I would like to hit maybe one elite, and it looks like I'm gonna have. It looks like I'm gonna be able to. As a matter of fact, it looks like there's no way for me to go forward without hitting at least one elite. Yeah, all right, all right, I like this path. I'm gonna go along this way. Then we'll hit the shop. Yeah, yeah, that's that's pretty much the perfect path. That's ideal. This fucking asshole. Limit breaks a tad useless right now. Uh, might as well get rid of those uh, artifacts. Get rid of the artifacts. It won't kill him. Let's see what we get. I'm actually gonna go see or am I? Yeah, yeah, you know, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> I'm like, am I? Okay. Uh, let's just defend as much as we can. I'll heal a little bit after this, but he's gonna go back to a 10. Sorry, that was my phone going off. And he's dead. Heavy blade? Absolutely, because we're going for this uh, heavy strength thing. Okay, infernal blade. Sorry, I was responding to something. Unblock damage. So that's not very good here. Eh, nothing's good actually. Shit. Alright. Spot weakness, ghostly armor. Okay, pen nib. Give me bludgeon, boy, yo. Give me bludgeon, boy. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> uh, I think I'd rather have a fire potion over a... No, not, not a, sorry, not a weak potion. Flash. Well, I have a lot of things that'll conflict with that, so I don't think that's a good idea. War cry... I feel like it just kind of takes space. Shockwave is pretty good, but I don't, I don't, I'm not running a four energy uh, thing right now. If I, if I had a, if I had a relic that was giving me four energy, I probably would do it. Uh, I will hit a fire before I hit that elite. So yeah, let's do this. I didn't like that, but 
Defend against the five. He actually, he's going to do a shit ton of damage to himself because of that. Which is hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, he's just going to kill himself next turn, so. First, let's do this. Let's try to defend as much as we can. And you're hurt bad. You're going to kill yourself. I am going to take the 10, unfortunately. So he just killed himself with because of my bronze scales. Yeah, this is that's a shame. Limit breaks useless because I don't have any strength right now at all. But we're absolutely gonna go the armor. We're gonna spot weakness. We'll battle trance. Mm, I'm gonna opt to not take any damage because I'm hitting a point where now this might be good. Eh, wasn't really what I was hoping for, but all right. I was hoping to get either my. Uh, Limit break. Yeah, he dead. So we're fine. Uh, Clash isn't very good. Cleave is okay. I think I might actually take True Grit for the sake of upgrading it, but I have other cards I want to upgrade before it. So I'm not quite sure. True Grit is because is it can exhaust a card of my choice once I upgrade it. So I'm going to do that. Because if I get a chance for a free upgrade, I might take it. Nah, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. All right, we're going to Smith. Our, our health is fine at the moment, so let's do Limit Break first. I was going to do Spot Weakness, but Limit Break can benefit us a bit heavier because it doesn't exhaust anymore. So let's uppercut you. And, oh, I'm doing a pen nib. Okay. I'm okay with that. Unfortunately, uh, maybe, I'm thinking maybe I should have struck uh, and then uh, did the fist. All right, I'm going to take one of these guys off the field right away. I'm only gonna do 29 if I do it to you, so that won't kill you. I'll do ye. Well, hold on a second. Nah. Alright, well, we're gonna heavy blade you. And we'll defend. Yeah, yeah, we'll defend. Save a little bit of damage. Alright, well, we'll use this. We use this. That's 15. Let's take zero damage. I know some of you guys are probably like, you need to outstrength them or out out attack them because they're just going to keep getting stronger. And you're not wrong. But now, yes, by killing one of them, I'm going to get something back. Unfortunately, it was Heavy Blade. If I get my bludgeon or really anything, where, where the fuck? Uh, yeah, we'll do our ghostly armor. Take as little damage as possible. Yeah, he, he's going to die next turn no matter what. We got through this with... I, I probably misplayed a little bit here, but we got through this relatively unscathed. Maybe not unscathed, but... I'm definitely taking that flame barrier. Get some more defense up in here. I'm going to smith because I got an elite... Or not smith, I rest because I have an elite coming up. Okay, that's good. So, I hate these fucking guys. This, this is the worst elite fight I could have got. Uh, we're going to do you because you'll untangle. As a matter of fact, let's go extra far to make sure you don't fucking do anything. Uh, oh, he was already weakened. That's right. Fuck, that was stupid. That was actually a pretty bad misplay. Okay. Yeah, he's gonna entangle me. We don't want that. Ooh, I got an extra energy so I can spot weakness for free. 35. It will not kill either one, so I'm going to flame barrier. 7 plus 7 is 14. Yeah, that's right. Okay. And I might as well. I would have liked to bludgeon one of them, but because it wouldn't kill him and take enough damage off the field, I decided to be boo. Okay. Yeah, let's... Uh uh, I probably sh that was stupid, but it actually worked. I should have played the defend first. Okay, I'm going to get an extra energy for this, so. Put the ghostly armor, make sure we take no damage. Oh, we got, yeah, actually I should have just attacked him. I got pen nib, so. Oh, well, you're dead. Flex, that's absolutely something I want. 
I do want to skip cards for the sake of, you know, skipping cards, but... Okay, he's already hurt a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit! Flame Barrier Bronze Scales is uh, hilarious! Alright, a shop? Yeah, that's what I wanted. Oh, so I was really, I mean, a long shot, but I was hoping for Apotheosis. Now, let's see. Is there anything I want to remove? Not really. This deck is working. I'm kind of thinking I might want to remove this bash, but because just because of the fact that I have uppercut. But at the same time, if I'm in a critical situation, this can save my fucking life. If I was running a block deck, and trench would be awesome, but I'm not, so... Also, I'd love this if I could afford it. Uh, let's take this, and if we get an opportunity to remove a card through a question mark, I will remove the bash. Okay, this is kind of a no-brainer. We're going to do Ghostly Armor to defend against the bulk of the attacks. Flame Barrier. And let's exhaust one of these. Mm-hmm. Colonel Blade first. Sword Boomerang. You won't die. I can't kill you no matter what I do. If I, if I were to block 10, I would block 9 if I only block 5. Okay, so, yeah. Oh, that's, uh, yeah, okay. It, it's fine, it's fine. Ugh, I just forgot about, uh, singing, no, not singing bull, uh, gremlin horn. And you're not gonna die. You might, no, you won't. I'm going to opt the shorter route here. Most of the reason because is because when he does this, he hurts himself. Let's go ahead and exhaust another card. I'm not taking any damage, so this block uh, plays with like Flame Barrier and stuff like that might be a little slow. You're dead. Okay. But I think it, Blood for Blood's pretty good. I think I'm going to keep the HP going, though. Uh, keep this HP train going. Ignore the addict. I was hoping to remove a card. All right, I'm gonna upgrade. I'm gonna upgrade my spot weakness. If I didn't have the bash, if I had removed it, I would have upgraded the uppercut. Let's see if we can get anything better. Yeah, we're doing this. Okay. All right, let's do that. Holy shit. Oh, that's such a shame. 17, huh? Let's see what this is. I'm really liking this deck. It's got a great mixture of defense and offense, and it's doing really well. Now, that weekend, I don't really appreciate. I won't get much benefit out of that. 15 plus 10 is 25, but he'll be vulnerable, so it'll actually do 30 versus the 28. So, yeah, let's do that. All right, his debuffs are gone, and he's got... <laughs> 23, it won't kill me. Holy shit, it was exactly 134. <laughs> uh, should I add more block? I kind of think I should. Because I'm heading into the... Oh, burning blood is so good. Oh, that's so good, too, though. 
Ah. Oh. Okay, Ronin Dome is only good if you don't if you know the enemy intents. I'm not entirely sure I'm good enough to use it properly. So I think I might go the safe method and keep my health up. That way I can be more aggro with my attacks. Now we want to go over the path of the most question marks possible. Yeah, I'm thinking that's it. So. We want as little combat as we can get on this particular floor, so. One card I'm really missing, I just realized now, is the Whirlwind. Mostly armor. Let's exhaust one of these, and I guess, I guess we'll just do that. I have already taken more damage than I wanted to, so. Trying to take less damage. Uh, what a Jesus Christ, there's just 40 damage. Just outright. You're doing a lot of damage. Let me see what other cards I get. Okay, that was worth it. 14, 28. Jesus, fuck. Let's use it on one of these guys. Yeah, that was much better use of that. Killing him is something I was definitely wanting to do because of the amount of damage he was doing. So I don't regret that. Pen will likely be used on you. Oh, okay. That would... I figured I was going to get an attack. Another spot weakness. I don't think that's necessary. My deck's already getting a little thicker than I'd like. I took a little bit more damage than I wanted to, so... Uh, for the red mask that applies one vulnerable to all enemies, I think. I don't think so. Nah, I don't think I don't think that's worth it. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that. I don't because I don't really like madness. Ah, uh, yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. Is it smart? But I'm doing it. As a matter of fact, I don't like this guy, so... This guy's... The Exploder's pretty fucking bad, too, so... Thirty-four. Hilarious. All right. We're gonna take him down as fast as we can, because he is the one who's gonna be the worst for us. Might as well play that right away. Headbutt. We'll hit. Before we do that, hit you with this. Put my heavy blade back on top. We'll play a defensive, negate some of the burn, some of the damage. It's not much, but. I don't really want to play the heavy blade. You're doing too much damage, so I didn't have a choice. Oh, I can still do it. I could take the 16 on the face and the... No, I'm not going to do that. That's stupid. That would be incredibly stupid. I wish I'd, I wish I'd drawn it up in, but... Oh, well. Killing the Exploder right there would have been a horrible decision. And I'm not really going to get a chance to do much here. Unfortunately. Flame Barrier would have been fucking awesome if I could have pulled it off, but... I will whittle you down, though. I'll kill you if I hit you again. I want to try to get some block... Before I start trying to... I will take 15 damage versus the 9... Or the 4, 5, 6... Yeah, I'll take 6 damage. The thing I'm trying, trying to grab Impervious... But because my deck just got shuffled again, I might not be... This is not advised, but I'm gonna try to do this. Battle Trance was a good draw. Oh, thank fuck. Alright, we're good. Oh, wait, if you kill him, you don't get hit by the... I'm stupid. If, if he's the last one, I mean... Thunderclap, that's definitely something I was absolutely looking for. Alright, 
just one of these is not that bad. I got pen nib, huh? Eh, that's all I can really do, fortunately. If I had a strength gain of any kind, that would have been great, but I didn't, so... Let's exhaust the other defend. Quite vulnerable. Uh, Dash might be more effective. I'm going to take a shit ton of damage no matter what I do. Actually, no. I'll take less damage this way. I thought Bash might be more effective, but he still has the vulnerable, so it wasn't. And you're dead. That's tempting. I'm going to not do it mostly because of the fact that my deck's getting a little thick and I'm, I'm going to heal. I'm paranoid as shit on the last floor. So forgive me. Wow. All right. I don't like the thorny boys. I, I don't like this group of enemies. It's horrible. But I want to kill this guy to stop getting dazes in my deck. We will spot weakness. We will ghostly armor and we will kill you. And we'll go ahead and hit one of these guys. Actually, no, we won't. Okay. Let's see what Infernal Blade gives us first. I wasn't going to use Flame Barrier anyway, so that's why I'm okay with that. I am going to block. Bludgeon would have been nice. I think I think he's the same way. If you kill him, you won't take the damage. That's right. Hmm? <laughs> no, no, my deck's thick. I'm only, this is the only chance I'll have for another shop if I don't, uh, unless I want three combats, which I don't. Can I afford to do that? Because the shop might not have anything I want. Uh, worst case scenario, I can remove a card, which I really, yeah, I really want to do. So, yeah, we're going to do that. The only thing I really was looking for was Apotheosis. So let's get rid of this curse. And I don't need any of these other cards. Another Heavy Blade. I've only got one, don't I? Yeah, but it is a Heavy Blade Plus. I'm not going to bother. I'm just going to go. Eh, not very good. Well, I got another shop. <laughs> Ooh, it might be nice, but I don't really have anything that necessarily benefits. So, this one. Of course I get the fucking maw. Okay. I'd like to flex if I can. Might as well. Let's do this. I know you might be looking at that going, that was a little bit of waste of potions. I probably should have saved those for the boss. But this guy can be a real pain in the dick. So let's apply vulnerable. We'll take the five and we'll try to defend against this next attack. Which will come after this. Ah, I would have liked to wait, but... That sucks. 12, 16. That's not too bad. It is bad enough for me to question it, but I need to, I need to kill him before he starts buffing himself to an extreme. We will double strength. 
He will probably die next turn because my strength is fucking sick. Yeah, he dead. And none of this is super beneficial, so. Okay, that's fucking horrible. 7-7, seven, seven, so it's absolutely... Hmm. I'm gonna do Flame Barrier. Because I want to keep Ghostly Armor, I'm gonna use it. That was a bad first turn, unfortunately. Now you're gonna start to be a problem. But they're gonna be a problem. No, no matter what happens here, I'm gonna have problems. So I need to kill these guys as fast as I can. Oh, I shouldn't have used the defend. Oh, well, I'm only gonna take five. That's not a big deal. Not right. Not at this particular moment. It's not anyway. 42 damage outright. I'm gonna do that because he's gotta die. Ugh. Oh, I'm gonna take 27 damage. That's really unfortunate. Well, he's dead, at least. And at my next rest side, I am going to have to rest. This is horrible. I need to get more defense. I need to be able to block against the nine. Actually, wait, no, if I kill him, I don't think I take damage. That's right. And that's kind of what I was asking for earlier, but I don't have a chance to remove a card, so. We got one more combat coming up, and it's getting real dicey. Uh, lose strike, please. <laughs> I'd rather not lose battle. Fuck! This is about the worst thing I could have got. Also, that was Facebook. This is actually the wor one of the worst fights I could have got. I would have rather fought an elite. This is fucking horrible. I hate this. I might actually die here. If I don't die here, I have a high chance of dying to the boss. Okay. Okay. You're attacking. So let's remove you. He'll die next turn, so I need to get 8 block. 12 block. Okay. Even better. Impervious. That's basically exactly what I was asking for. Yeah, no, this is perfect. This is actually perfect. Holy shit. <laughs> and you're dead. Uh, that was... Very stressful pommel strike. I'm going to take it because I can get draw out of it. And we're resting. Absolutely. There's no question about that. That pushed me over my original max. Dota and Deca, it's kind of a piece of shit, but I do have Lizard Tail. And we'll Ghostly Armor. Give me a fucking Heavy Blade or a Bludgeon. Come on, you can do it. I mean, that'll do it. I, I'd do this if I didn't have pen nib. All right, we, we've committed, so you know what? Gonna take 18 damage. I will revive with half of my HP, which is 60. I could defend against this attack, or I could try to weaken you further. I'm going to weaken you further. The only reason I'm going to be this risky is because I have Lizard Tail. If I didn't have it, I would have blocked right there with Flame Barrier. So let's go ahead and do this. Maybe I should have pommeled first, but I opted not to. We're going to do this. I'm going to take the, I'm going to take the 32 damage on the face. I can die. That's the only good thing about this. It won't save me. 
from my initial death, but it will reduce the damage I take for the next for, uh, part of this fight. Now, it's important that you die. You're not gonna die. He won't die unless I get more energy. I might die here. Not in this attack, but I don't I don't know if I'll beat Donu. I I, I kind of don't think. Oh my! I'm dead. I I, I <laughs> I'm dead. Uh, maybe I did go a little too aggro there in the beginning, but I had to take try to take one of them out. That's unfortunate. I feel like I really could have had that. Oh, well. Uh. All right, well, in that case, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you want to join my Discord, link is in the description below. And if you like to see content from me every single day, feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. And I can't really talk right now because I'm a little distraught. But thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye!